Hello, this is my small laboratory. I will start presenting on this side where I have a test bench with uh, 100 kilowatt, 130 kilowatt motor there and 200 kilowatt motor. Here two controllers with silicon carbide transistors and solid state capacitors, a battery bank, a control module, uh, here a power analyzer where I can see all the parameters directly on the display. So I'm measuring the current that goes into the DC bus, the current that goes into the motor, plus the voltages on each phase. So in this way, the power analyzer computes the power that goes into the motor. The torque sensor there in the middle also shows here the torque and the RPM and the power. It goes back to the power analyzer so I can compute as well the efficiency in real time here, here in this, I can compute the efficiency of the inverter, of the motor, both of the, both in the same time, in real time. While I'm tweaking the parameters or changing some parameters in advance angle here in the controller, where I have the interface connected via the CAN bus to the main controller. So maximum RPM. 2700 RPM. Now we add uh, even higher loads. So, yeah, the battery now is 8 amp. The battery current is 8 amp. But now I will start to engage the, the load. So, increase the load. We can notice the torque. So it's running, now it's running at uh, 106 newton meters, 126, 27 phase current and 136 amps drawn from the battery, but as we can see, from the battery actually it's drawing only 16 amps, the difference in efficiency. And we can also see the parameters of the inverter and the motor efficiency, inverter efficiency 99.4, motor efficiency 96.4. 9% so this is really good RPM 2200 106 I think I can further increase the throttle a little bit yeah 113 115 123 124 so yeah, this is